What do I think about this one? <laughs> This one, uh, oh man. It's a little bit easier to play, uh, obviously, because of with the, the higher action. Um, I'm also surprised at the, how, the way the strings react and the, the tension. Um, there's a lot of, I can kind of dig into it and it doesn't feel like you're choking the instrument, so you can kind of dig in um, a little bit with this one. I think as I was playing, I kind of got a little bit heavier into the strumming. And the fact that an instrument so old could withstand, um, you know, a little more aggressive playing is kind of unbelievable. Um, the tone, the intonation is great. Again, like the blend on certain chords, just sounds so, so rich and so beautiful and so balanced. You know, again with the with the open C's, you know, trying to get the, the lower lower frequencies out. You know, chords like this. that some of the higher notes too can it still resonates uh, for for some time it doesn't just die out you know like that the intonation is spot on all the way up the fretboard It's just crazy that these instruments were were made were made uh, were ex you know existed um, you know during uh, the Hawaiian monarchy, which is kind of unreal and unbelievable. People were playing these. <laughs> so I'm like super honored to to be able to play this for you today. Um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it.